throat Indian head. <clears throat> I uh, graduated from Lackey High School, and my grandfather lived in Nanjimoy. And his father lived in Charles County, and his father was in the Civil War and came to live in Port Tobacco. So I have a little experience with Charles County. Uh, my background is an economist. I've represented the U.S. in meetings and conferences in Brussels, Paris, and London. That's part of my background, which was my previous life, so to speak. Um, my wife, who lost, I lost my wife five years ago. She was a, um, a park ranger in environmental education. And I've been involved in education as well. I'm an honorary member of the Maryland Parent Teachers Association. I've been in comprehensive plans before. Um, one of the things that I want to call to your attention is a flag over here. It's the state flag of Maryland. I don't know, I'm sure many of you know the background on it, but I think it's interesting to note. And that is the insignia on that flag is representative of the Calvert family, George Calvert, his family, Baltimore, Lord Baltimore's. They came over in 1634, left England in 1633, came over here with 300 members of their troop, and they came over here because they were seeking religious freedom. And they came over here and they found it. And I think every time I look at that flag, I think of the freedom that we have here in the state of Maryland. And also the insignia that you see on that flag is over here in the, in the insignia that you have, that we have here for Charles County, which I think is great. There's a lot of, we have a lot of history here. We have a lot of significance. It's been my responsibility and my joy over the last um, years, some 10, 15 years, to um, do historical research in Charles County. I'm very impressed with what we have here. And I might tell you this, when that group came over from England in 1634, they were very, very impressed with the Potomac River and the quality of what we had here in streams. And today we're all, I think it's important to all of us. And I know this was my wife's because she saw it and it was so important to her to see to it that her, the students that she taught knew about environmental education, knew about our uh, rivers and our streams here and what we were, and we looked to these children because they were stewards, this would be their responsibility in the years ahead. And I think as we look at this, we're not here tonight just to, simply to take care of our own interests. We're here because we owe it to the youth, because they are going to be the future citizens of Charles County and the future citizens of this country, and we owe it to them. Thanks. Thank you, Mr. Bowles.